This is Leonard Anderson. This particular project is a Eco Steel two bedroom ADU outside of Houston, Texas. The project is basically like a giant erector set. All the pieces and parts are marked with a specific part number that identifies them. Most of the panels are factory cut to the correct length. You want to have a good uh, level baseline around the building so that, especially with horizontal panels, when you get back around the building to the corner where you started, your horizontal panel joints are all lined up and the panels are level. We have finished the structural framing for the job. We've got everything plumbed up and square and we're now in the process of putting wall panels up. The insulated wall panels, again, provided by Eco Steel. The first thing you do with the wall panels, you put your base trim on, and then there's some little J clips that are also put on at the bottom, and they support the bottom edge of the insulated wall panels. Those J clips are installed with a laser to make sure that they're perfect all the way around the building. And then the wall panels are stacked up horizontally on those J-clips. Panels come pre-cut to length. The only thing that's not cut are the openings for the doors and the windows. Those are all field cut as needed as they go around the building. Windows sometimes can move, be relocated. Door sizes are not known precisely at the order stage, and so those things are subject to minor adjustments, and that's why they're field cut. Typically it's easier to do the wall panels first and then do the roof panels after that. Once the panels are up and the framed openings for the doors and the windows are cut out, then we'll install the trim that goes around the openings and then the doors and the windows will be installed after that.